the American people did not overwhelmingly elect President Trump to be our polite commander in chief. We wanted a fighter and I think that's exactly what we got. Now I can't speak for President Trump, but I can tell you how I interpret his tweets. So okay, this is my interpretation of Trump tweeting today. It was all about revealing the fakeness of Mika or Micah. I don't know how you say her name, but she's a phony. And he points that out by saying that she is one way on the camera when she is her progressive self uh, demeaning and demoralizing and attacking Trump every time she can. But she is completely another way when she's chasing after him for three days at Mar-a-Lago trying to get his attention. He also emphasizes his point of fake a little bit more with his facelift comment. And I know that that wasn't pretty. But guess what? She's a phony. And he uses his own special Trump speak to reveal it. I for one appreciate it. And I know I'm not the only one. I don't know why it's so hard for the fake news networks to understand that the American people love the way he speaks. We love it. We love the way he tweets. We're tired of political correctness and politeness that hides all of the real problems. And the fake news is a real problem. And that's what he's been exposing. Don't forget, everyone, that we want him this way. It's not always pretty. And in fact, today a friend and a fellow Trump supporter told me that he voted for Trump to be a bull in a China shop. And my friend Alan wants to see China busted. And guess what? Today, President Trump broke a whole lot of teacups and saucers. And for those of us that really love him and respect him and worked so hard here in Michigan to get him elected, Sweeping up the Trump mess is no problem for us at all. So I want you all to visit michigantrumprepublican.com. We have a bevy of tour stops across Michigan. I think we have another 11. And by stopping by one of these tour stops, we're going to get you plugged in and you're going to learn how you can join the team to protect our president and uh, help keep Michigan great again. Thanks so much, guys.